Hello everybody, it's Chris here and today we have something a little different. So today we have a box, a trading card box opening. Yes, that's right, all the way back from 1996. This was released by Skybox. This is DC Stars. So this is all the characters from the DC Universe. So you've got Superman, you've got Aquaman, you've got Batman, you've got Joker. So this is the booster box or the equivalent of a booster box. So it has 18 packs of cards in it. There's five cards in each one plus a puzzle pack. So it's all the way from 1996. So some real vintage there. Brand new and sealed. These are only about five or six pounds on eBay. But I thought it would be quite good fun. Something a little different. Open up a booster box here. So I'll get into it quickly and then we'll get we'll fire right into it. So something completely different. I don't think there's anything particularly good to pull, but it'll be good to see some old vintage cards. Opening that pack fresh 1996 booster box. Here we go. Some of the artwork on the front. I believe there's 45 cards in the set. Really nice artwork on the front there, the packs. Like I say, something just a bit of fun. Open these up. Should get some Supermans, should get some Batmans there. So we'll take out all the packs there. There's loads of these. I'm not quite sure why they have no real value. Like I said, they are nearly 30 years old now. 1996. Nothing special, but definitely a bit of fun. Open up some vintage packs. Obviously, this is not going to happen with Pokemon because that box would be about 10 grand but here we go there so we'll open up and see what we get so we start off with so all the artwork is from the original comic books which is really interesting there so we start off with Mara Pa Kent so Superman's parents we got Lex Luger there we got Bloodwind we got Pacemaker you'll recognize a lot of these from movies or from the comic books themselves you got low bowl there, and we've got a golden Superman card. So there's nine cards all together for this part, and they make up a big picture. In this set, I believe there's 45. So on the back, it tells you a little bit of information when they first appeared in the comic book, and then a little bit more information about the character, which is cool. Even down to how much they weigh, what color eyes they are, different information about the character so that's pretty cool really nice artwork again like i said original from the comic book there we have our gold superman there so we'll fire through them like i said something a little different just for a bit of fun box opening vintage 90s cards i've got a load more we'll open loads more up but i thought it'd be interesting to do something a little different there shazam obviously got a movie and another Superman, so definitely not a rare card there. So we've got two Supermans, pretty cool, the gold background. Like I say, they are part of the of the picture there. I mean, there's a good chance we'll get all the cards from the whole entire set here. Because there's not that many. Oh, nice. This is a really nice Superman. I believe this is number one of the set. Yep, yeah, number one of the set there. First appearance, June 1939, and Man of Steel 86 is the current version. So really cool there. And obviously his, his nemesis there, Lex Luger. And we got Batman. So two of the, probably the most recognisable characters from the DC Universe. Batman there, first appearance, 1939. So same year after. So Superman was 38, Batman was 39. Guy I've never seen before, from, from the Green Lantern, I think. I think he is the Green Lantern. Yep, there we go. Guy Gardner. Ocean Master. And we got Shazam there. So cool, pretty cool so far. We've got we've seen the main characters there. That's a really nice card. These two are really nice cards there. Very patriotic there, Superman. And cool little bit of information about it. Also, carry on. Hopefully, we can get a Joker card or Penguin or Catwoman or Flash. 
Flash would be pretty cool as well. So we've got Penguin there. He's really cool there, Penguin. Wonder Woman as well. That's a nice Wonder Woman card. Some of these are really nice. You know, they're really good cards. Obviously, they're not... It's just a shame they're not worth anything. But them being not worth anything allows me to do a box break for you all. And we have the Green Lantern there, which is part of the part, part of the picture set. So again, there's... If you want to fancy doing one of these yourself, there's loads of these boxes available on eBay. They're only about five or six pounds, like I said. So it'd be fun. And we have another penguin there. Cool. We have an Aquaman as well. Really nice, cool there. Deathstroke. Geoforce. Ocean Master again. And the Flash. That's a really nice one there. Really nice card, the Flash there. The artwork on these are great. Obviously, it's from the vintage comic books. So I knew the artwork would be good. Open this up. Wrapping up the empty packets already. Dead shot. Nice. Got another Superman there. Another cool card. The Flash. That's really nice artwork there. Really nice. When was the Flash first introduced? 59. 5960 as the Flash and then reintroduced as Crisis of Infinitive Earths in 86. Black Lightning, another character I've never seen before. He's 70s, Nightwing, and there's Robin to go along with the other cool cards. There we have the picture cards. So let's keep going, see if we can get the Joker card. I think there are four special cards, hollows or rares, whatever you want to call them. There are four of them. I believe it's the main characters from the franchise. I think we've got one there. That's cool. We've got one at the back. This guy, Deadstroke again. Because it's a small set, there'll be lots of doubles. Deadshot, is that two in the same packet? No. That was Deathstroke and this is Deadshot. And we have a special rare card there. So we have the Green Lantern. Collect all four hot foil bonus cards featuring DC comic greats. From Spider-Man, Batman, Wonder Woman and Green Lantern. I think these are quite rare. Maybe one in every box. So that's pretty cool. And there's Robin there from the picture set. All nine. You have Batman, Flash, Hawkman, Robin... Superman, Wonder Woman, Shazam, Aquaman, Green Lantern. I'm pretty sure we'll be able to get most of them. But the gold rare card there is pretty cool. I think these have looked really good in slabs, you know. Like you can put them on display. They're pretty cool. They're going to be they're decent centering for a card. So. Doomsday, another bad guy there. Blue Beetle, that's pretty cool, Blue Beetle there. Aquaman, 41, it's nearly 100 years old, a lot of these. Spider-Man, uh, Spider the Superman and the Batman, Aquaman, late 30s, early 40s, which is really cool. 92, around there, and Wonder Woman, really cool artwork. Love the vintage Wonder Woman. Really nice. Let's carry on. I do have another box of these which I'm going to just keep. Because I thought they are pretty cool. Yeah. But I thought I'd break one. Something different, like I said before. Owlman. Different. Guardian there. Auron. Vandal Savage. And the Batman card, picture card. So we're starting to get the picture cards now. We've got one, two, three, four, five different ones there. We're still looking for Superman, I believe. Or did we have a Superman before? Yeah. I think we had a Superman before. So there's the picture cards there. Let's have a look. What else? So yeah, I was just kind of looking for... Oh, I was on eBay looking for the 90s cards. Seeing what it was about, there's anything from when I was a kid. Obviously, Pokemon stuff is super hot at the moment, but a bit out of my price range to open up for a video. 
We've got Lois Lane there. We've got another character there. Another Bloodwind there. Shazam's there. And love this artwork on the Flash. Really nice. That's really cool. Super cool. A few packs left to go. Keep going. Great pack artwork. I'd say the the packs are like a like a plasticky foily texture. Different I've never seen before. Another penguin, that's cool there. Another blue beetle. Wonder Woman again's nice. If I can get a whole set of these, I'll get them either put in a binder or I'll put them in penny sleeves and keep them as a nice collection. Pretty cool set there so far. Obviously with our special hollow card, if you can call it that there. I think these are the only ones that have a tiny little bit of value, but you're still only talking about three or four quid. But cool, would pay for the box, you know? Do any of you remember getting these cards when you were younger? Can you remember them from the 90s? I'm trying to think back, and the only ones I kind of remember are the Marvel, Marvel and kind of X-Men, but that was more a little bit later in the 90s, I think. We used to get them free with comic books and that kind of stuff. Robin there. So we haven't had the Robin before. Catwoman woman again there. Flash. Great pack. Fire. I think there's fire and ice. And that is the pitch card there for Aquaman. Really cool. So yeah, let me know if you had these cards when you were young before. Is it something you would do just for a bit of fun, you know? It makes an interesting video. Um, I did look at the Marvel ones, but they are quite a lot more expensive if you can get hold of them than the DC. Just popularity, I suppose. Alfred there, Joker, that's the lovely one. I love the artwork on the Joker one there. Proper classic 90s Joker, that. 1940, Batman 1, first appearance. Alfred there. 43, 1943. Fire, Deathstroke again. Hawk and Aquaman's card there again for the picture. The nine card picture. Yep, like I say, I've got other cards coming as well. I'll open up some more random packs. Just to make a little bit different, mixing it up. Obviously, I can't get a lot of stock at the moment. For my eBay, so just having other things to do. Aquaman again there. Shazam. And we had the Green Lantern there. Like I said before, I think it's 45 cards altogether. I believe there is a card, like a checklist card, which is the 45th card. I don't know, They, I think they maybe brought a couple more sets out after these but I'm not 100% sure the Batman card there again and the Joker card really nice Green Man Hunt, Martian Man Hunter Black Condor Monarch and Shazam again three packs left let's see if we can get another special card but I do have a funny feeling it is only one per box which makes sense I suppose for a rare Booster Gold there. Aquaman. We've got plenty of Aquamans. This would be something cool maybe. I'll give these away. I could give cards away to people at my my event. My toy event. Be something cool. Something different. There we go. Batman. So what would you like to see me open next? Obviously Pokemon. I've been doing a lot more Pokemon recently. As something a little different from the game pickups um, and the eBay sales and just all these kind of interesting fun stuff I like to do. Robin is a really nice card there. I love that. Some of these definitely I'm going to be keeping like John Stewart there. Panther, no, I've seen that before. Deadshot we've seen at the start. And that's the Hawk card. So I believe we've got all of them. Possibly. Was it in this set here? Superman was at the start, wasn't he? There, so I think we've got all the picture cards there. One, two, three, four, 
five, six, seven, eight. We're missing one. We're missing the Shazam one. Did we pull that before? Did we? There we are. So we have all the picture cards. So we can make up the picture now. Picture is really cool. Which will look good in a nine sleeve yeah, binder, a card binder holder, which is really cool. We've got the whole lot there. Last packet, we'll open this up. Probably a lot of the cards we've already seen so far. I do fancy doing po Japanese Pokemon cards one time. They seem to be a little bit cheaper. But I've got loads more coming up as well. Loads of different sets and stuff. Alfred, Martian, Black Condor, Guardian, Panther again, and Aquaman. So what did you think of this? Like I said, something completely different. So we have DC Stars, by Skybox, 18, so half booster box there. Really cool there. Something different. Thank you very much for watching. So if you enjoyed this kind of video, don't forget to watch and subscribe. Hit the notification bell so you know when new videos are coming up. Drop a comment down below. Who is your favourite DC superhero? Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next time.